about 300 jobs are being cut from the Peel District School Board, with these cuts mainly coming from the Spec Ed Department as well as Equity-based departments. These teachers worked out of the central office or a field office, and they were traveling teachers providing specialized supports for students with special needs such as autism, hearing, or vision loss. And this entire program run out of the board office had over 100 teachers, and it was entirely cut. And these teachers provided supports to individual students, to entire classrooms, to students with special needs and disabilities. And while the board has said that some of these positions are going to come back on the local school level the problem is that they're not going to be at every school meaning that some students with these disabilities are going to have to travel to get the services that they need and i don't know about you but i don't as a parent have the time in the middle of the day to leave my job pick up my kid bring them to a new school just so they can get the publicly funded education that they deserve when we talk about the harms of ford's cuts this is what they look like and this is only the beginning it doesn't end here because since ford took office he has been making class sizes larger he's been cutting spec ed funding he's been cutting autism funding he's been cutting ea funding he is making our schools unbearable to learn in and unbearable to teach in. Very similar to surgeries and everything in healthcare, very similar to Service Ontario, very similar to everything else that Doug Ford puts his hands in. The goal is to make it so it's unsustainable, it fails, it collapses, and they have an excuse to privatize. Doug Ford is incapable of governing, either out of malice or incompetence.